One of the most enjoyable parts about writing with a fountain pen is filling it up with colorful ink. However, making an inky mess is what deters many people from writing with a fountain pen. Having ink-stained fingers may be a badge of honor for pen enthusiasts, but most writers prefer a no-fuss, mess-free way to fill their pen. Even the most seasoned fountain pen aficionado can struggle to fill a pen using an ink sample vial or drawing up ink from a half-empty bottle. In this video, we're going to show you how to fill your pen cleanly and get every last drop of ink. Let's get inky with it. Since it's the most common method to fill a fountain pen, we're going to first focus on filling using a fountain pen converter. Normally, you would attach the converter to the section of the fountain pen and submerge the nib and feed into ink to fill the pen. This method becomes more difficult if you're trying to reach into an ink sample vial or a bottle of ink that is half empty. To shortcut the process, some may opt to use a blunt needle syringe to draw up ink and deposit it directly into the converter. Tonighter's new fountain pen snorkel is a useful tool that connects directly with your converter, effectively turning it into a blunt needle syringe. Its design is compatible with most converters, including the industry standard International, Schmidt K5 converter, Lamy, Parker, Pilot, Schaefer, and others. Unfortunately, Sailor and Platinum converters do not fit. All you have to do is fit it on the end of the converter and draw up ink as you would normally do with the section attached. The slender adapter measures 2 and 7 eighths inches, 73 millimeters, in length, which can reach deep into most fountain pen ink bottles. But wait, the snorkel can do a lot more than just fill your fountain pen with ink. It can also be used as a tool to create inky works of art, serve as a cocktail straw, and it could save someone's life by performing an emergency tracheotomy. Just kidding. The snorkel is only meant to draw up ink into your converter. It's an extremely useful tool for any fountain pen enthusiast that has multiple converter filling fountain pens. So what if you prefer piston filling pens or need to fill your pen with ink on the go? Getting the last drop of ink is difficult for internal filling pens as there is no other option other than to submerge the nib in ink. Some ink bottles do have built-in reservoirs. Sailor Gentle Inks, Platinum Standard Ink Colors, Pilot's 70 milliliter bottle, Ackerman, Levenger, and Mont Blanc ink bottles are built to make filling your pen easier once the ink level begins to drop. To help get to the bottom of a Noodler's ink bottle, you can purchase an Ink Miser Intra Bottle inkwell that works the same way. But what if you don't have access to your ink bottles? How would you fill your pen on a business trip, a vacation, or a nature hike? Bring along the convenient Peniter pen filler this simple, ingenious design is compatible with pens that have a section diameter between 9.5 millimeters and 13.5 millimeters. You can test this by using the side of the paper carton that packages the filler. How does it work? Unplug the pen filler by removing the finely knurled top. Fill up the transparent reservoir with up to 10 milliliters of ink. Insert your fountain pen using slight pressure. Rotate the broadly knurled ring clockwise until the pen is locked in place. Turn the inkwell upside down and actuate the filling mechanism of the pen. Unlock the pen by turning the broadly knurled ring counterclockwise. Remove the pen and close the inkwell by inserting the top back in. Wipe down your pen and you are good to go. If you prefer a higher end option, the Visconti Traveling Inkwell is the first of its kind and includes an eyedropper to fill the inkwell. We hope that you could take some of the tips from this video to fill your fountain pen with more ease and cleanliness. Any of the fountain pen filling accessories mentioned in this video can be obtained by shopping at our website at goldspot.com, where we also offer hundreds of fountain pen inks from around the world. If this video has helped you, please give us a thumbs up and tell us in the comments below about your biggest inky disaster. Subscribe to get more helpful pen advice, how-to videos, and in-depth pen reviews. Hit the bell bing, to be notified when we do our weekly live unboxings. And as always, stay inky, my friends. Take care. Thank you.